I'm here tonight with my beautiful wife, Pamela, who is buzzing because she just came from this big marketing seminar downtown Atlanta called the Digital Summit. And uh, Pamela runs the marketing department for a medical device company called Avenos. And so she was down there picking up some good ideas. So share with us a few of the good ideas that you learned. Okay, well, one of the key takeaways and um, I learned was really, a, it was a fundamental of marketing, which is the importance of understanding who your customers are. Right. Um, before you do anything, you've got to understand, and it's got to go beyond demographics. Where I think a lot of marketers fail is that they think that if they've defined their customers by age, gender, um, you know, race, things like that, right. that that's enough information. But 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 in reality, you really need to understand and drill down to your customers in terms of the behaviors that they exhibit and actions that they take, mm -hmm. their um, what their needs are, and because people can't be um, categorized just by their age. And right, nature. and we're in an age now where that data is available like it's never been in the past. That data is very much available. What, what other uh, uh, tips do you have for us? Well, um, beyond understanding your customer, you've also got to um, understand that you don't want to chase after every shiny object. And when mm. I say shiny object, I mean every um, digital platform mm. out there, Pinterest, um, Instagram, Tumblr, Snapchat, Tumblr, all that. New face. You you really need to match your audience with the channels that they use. Right. And and if they're looking for information on Facebook or they use Tumblr or what have you, there's where you need to focus your dollars and your time. Sure, sure. Anything else? And I would say the third key takeaway was that video is still king. Mm. I mean, it's it's a great way to engage with your audience through video yeah either so. either through you know using video as an entertainment um, providing entertainment or information right and, and you can do it with in you know bite-sized pieces to where people consume that video um, a lot more um, than they do with the printed word sure and you know they say that a picture is worth a thousand words so a video must be worth a million exactly and we learned we, one tidbit we did learn today was that on YouTube videos, 51% of the videos that are searched for on YouTube are how-to videos. Wow. So, wow. Like how to make a video like this one. Exactly. All right. Well, thank you, Pamela. Great job. See you guys later. Thank you.